Hi everyone, so today I thought I'd share with you what toys I currently have for my guinea pig. As you can see, I have a whole drawer full of toys to show you. I thought I'd also mention that I personally be believe that toys are an important part of caring for guinea pigs. Now, obviously they don't play like you'd expect a child, for example, to play with toys. Playing for a guinea pig would be knocking a toy around, chewing on it, destroying it, that kind of thing. And they get a lot of enjoyment out of it. And there are people that say, you know, oh, I don't buy any toys for my guinea pigs because they don't play. Honestly, I don't believe a word they say because you clearly haven't tried every type of toy. I mean, even if it's just a cardboard tube and that's what they like playing with, there's always something I've found that my guinea pigs enjoy knocking around, playing with, destroying and chewing. And they're all different. They all like different things. Pippin, for example, when he was alive, really, really liked plastic toys, whereas some of my other guinea pigs at the moment prefer wooden toys, like Spike, for example, loves wooden toys so he can destroy them and chew them. And yes, they get destroyed, but that's their version of playing with a toy. And it keeps them active, it keeps them entertained. It's a good enrichment if you've got a toy that dispenses treats or is a bit of a challenge for them like a puzzle toy it's really good for them and I'd much rather provide them with toys even if they didn't play with them just in case they wanted to rather than not bother at all so that's my personal view on toys and I think it's really really important and is a great part of guinea pig care and keeping them happy so that's my opinion on it. So I've actually got a few toys hanging up in the cages so I'll show you which toys I have that are currently hanging up and then I'll show you the toys that are all in the drawer. So the first toy I have hanging up in the boys cage is this fruit plastic toy with a jingle bell at the bottom and it's just different types of fruit shaped in kind of baby link type things and they like knocking this around. I've had this for years and I really like it. It's actually a bird toy, I think. I also have this Baby Link toy. Baby Links are really, really cheap, cost effective and easy to find and purchase. And guinea pigs tend to like knocking them around, pulling them about. Bailey used to like destroying them, which was fine. But they're quite a nice little cheap and easy toy to find. So I've just got a bunch of those. So at the back of the cage I have this colourful chew toy, it's like a chain chew toy, just with colourful pieces on and they tend to go in phases of sometimes chewing and destroying these and then leaving them for months. But I always provide one in the cage because there's something they always end up chewing. I also have a few Christmas toys hanging up in the cages at the moment and that's just because I don't think they're necessarily, this one's probably the most obvious Christmassy one, but they need using so instead of saving them until next year I just thought I might as well put them in and see if they like them. So this is the Holly Chew Toy that I purchased this Christmas just gone and there's also a snowflake hanging chew toy in this cage. This is another Christmas toy that I currently have and it's just a piece of wood with a heart shape in it and I also have this Christmas toy which again isn't necessarily majorly Christmassy, it's got some, this, I don't know whether they're supposed to be stars or snowflakes and a little tree on there. This is probably the Christmas, most Christmassy bit about it that it's got kind of candy cane colours but that's just hanging in the girls cage so they can play with that. In the girls cage I also have this wooden willow chew toy that I've had for a few years. I also have another Christmas toy again it's not majorly Christmassy it's just pieces of wood, red beads and a pink star which is quite nice because it's a long quite big toy so it should last quite a long time. I also have this heart and flower chain chew toy that again I've had for a few years and they have chewed a little bit. You can't quite see because I tend to turn the chewed sides to the side of the cage that you can't see but they have chewed the back of it quite well. And then I also have these other three hanging toys at the side here. I've got this homemade donut hanging toy, a kind of jingly toy one that's a bird toy and then this is actually a rabbit kebab I've just threaded some random chews on for them and I also have this apple and it's got another little kind of beaded fruit at the bottom there and, and a kebab which they also really enjoy chewing they've there were actually two apples originally but they chewed one off so I put the bead there to make it a bit more interesting for them. So I'll do the rest of the toys in a kind of order, starting with what's left of the Christmas toys that are in the drawer. I have got a homemade one, but I'll show that with the homemade items. So I've got this reindeer hanging toy, a little pudding rollabout toy, a Christmas tree. I have this snowman, but as you can tell, it has just broken as I took it out of the drawer. 
and this really cute Santa hanging toy. So here I have some food related items that I have purchased. I have a couple more that I'll show you in a second. I love food related toys for the guinea pigs because I think they're adorable. So here I've just got some sweets. These are quite thin, just wooden chews. I've got some lollipops down here, donut, and then general fruit and veg, bananas, watermelons, pineapple orange tomato apples mushrooms that kind of thing and i think they're really really adorable i love the food related items i also have a chocolate ice cream a strawberry ice cream and a knickerbocker glory as well as two little cupcakes so on to the homemade items i used to actually have a lot more but i decided to give a lot away i just was collecting too much funnily enough the homemade items are what they chew the most they really really like chewing these i don't know whether it's because i know what to make in terms of what they like to chew with the shape and things like that but these are just a few of my homemade items so I've got food related items like a hamburger, lollipop, pizza, cake, a candy corn, I've got a little biscuit here, a donut, a bourbon biscuit. People always ask me why I spelt this wrong it's just because when I was selling it on the shop it couldn't be exactly like the proper bourbon biscuit so I spelt it in my own version. I also have a Christmas tree, a lollipop, a cheese wedge, a pie, throw about toys, a little cake, a minion chew and a tardu. I then have these three little throw about toys and I think they're really cute. They've got either plastic pieces or wooden pieces and this one's shaped like a heart, leaves and just circles and I really like these. I bought these off a kind of DIYer a few years back and they've lasted really well and I think they're really cute the guinea pigs really like throwing these about so now I have some jingly toys I've downgraded these massively I used to have hundreds well not hundreds but dozens of them they were everywhere I had about 30 of these so now I only have two for the guinea pigs and one for the tortoises because they also like pushing those around I have some larger ones at the back here a wooden one these I've decided to keep a few of because they really like throwing these about as well as these and just a couple of these smaller ones and then I just have a random selection of what's left so I have a few beach themed things like a kite and a beach ball there's an octopus there a caterpillar a couple of dinosaurs and these throwback ones which they really really like this is actually a homemade one that should have been with the homemade things but it, I forgot about it so it's ended up with these and I also have this treat dispensing toy which they love as well. And the last few items are all bigger items that I consider toys. So the first is this seesaw that is homemade obviously and made for them. They're actually really good in this and the baby guinea pigs like Pumpkin and Bramble and Spike really like climbing up this if I put a treat on it. They're very good at figuring it out and going up and down it. I did train them to use it and they're really really good at it and they really like climbing up it because they enjoy climbing anything. I then have this hay roller, it has a hole on this end to put hay into. It's just a colourful hay roller that is a kind of a enrichment toy. It's like a, almost a, could be used as a treat dispensing toy if you put veg in it or hay or whatever. But also they like to push it around. And lastly I have this Christmas tree and it just slots together so it stands up but I thought I'd show you it like this. And obviously I don't use this only at Christmas but quite a nice little chew toy for them it's very thick and it should last a few years so those are all of my guinea pig toys at the moment i hope you enjoyed seeing what i have i know it's quite a lot still but what's great is for example the toys will last a few years i won't have to go out buying toys to replace them in a hurry and i think it's great to have a selection so that you maybe not this big but a bit of a selection so you can switch them around because they do get bored easily so being able to swap them about for different types of toys is really great and keeps them entertained so thank you so much for watching write down in the comments what toys you have for your guinea pigs and also what toy is your favorite or if you have another type of pet like a rabbit or a hamster write down what toys you have for them thanks again for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye everyone